Hi, uh, my name is Chris O'Prey. I'm a software developer with the Cambridge Innovation Development Group here at Microsoft Research Cambridge. Uh, today I'm going to talk to you about the Twofoot PC project which was developed with the computer mediated living group here and is looking at a way of adding in-air gestures as a new input modality over and above the keyboard and mouse to the system. The Twofoot PC project is a research looking at the combination of human computer interaction, design and technological advancement. Um, what we're doing is using a stereoscopic or depth camera such as the Kinect to see the hands and actually track those and be able to allow you to do simple ergonomic gestures over and around the keyboard that allow you to interact with Windows without taking away from the keyboard and mouse acting as an external modality. Some of the gestures that we have implemented includes um, gestures such as peak where your hand acts as a proxy for another document. This peak will take you to another application when you take your hand away it brings you back to where you were. If you do the peak and it's not the application you want you can simply switch with the other hand and this will cycle through all the applications until you get to the application you care about. Once you get there you can do a peek and pin gesture by pointing at the other hand which locks you back to where you were. So the next gesture uses the search feature built into Windows 8. You simply make the shape of a magnifying glass over the keyboard it will take you to the search application. So the next step then is to be able to go through things like the start screen and the desktop. Simply by swiping over the edge of the keyboard you can go to the start screen do it again, it will take you back to the desktop. Bring both hands together and flick sideways as if you're wiping the desk clean. Clears all the applications from the screen. Do it again and everything will be returned. And finally in the application set is if you're working with something like Internet Explorer which has a history, you can very simply swipe over the edge of the keyboard to go back in the history, swipe over the other edge of the keyboard to go forward in the history. So this whole project is a concept of taking user experience design and hardware innovation and combining to provide an extra modality of interacting with your PC over and above the keyboard and mouse and touch that we've traditionally seen in the system. Thank you very much. Each year, Microsoft Research hosts hundreds of influential speakers from around the world, including leading scientists, renowned experts in technology, book authors and leading academics, and makes videos of these lectures freely available.